Oracle is pleased to add two new components to its JD Edwards Internet of Things, or IoT, solution. The IoT Orchestrator Studio and the IoT Cloud Service Integration. Released in July of 2015, the IoT Orchestrator takes inputs from external devices, filters the data, and applies rules in order to update the JDE forms through the use of the AIS server. Specifically, an orchestration looks for four XML files whitelists, rules, cross-references, and service requests. These XML files originally had to be created and modified manually, requiring specialized skills. But in Tools Release 9.2.0.2, JD Edwards offers the IoT Orchestrator Studio, an intuitive user interface that empowers your business analysts to become efficient and effective citizen developers. The Orchestrator Studio allows you to create XML files from scratch, while walking you through the process step by step. You can also select existing orchestrations from the drop-down, then drill into each component and add or remove complexities according to the business needs. Another exciting new offering is the pre-built integration with the IoT Cloud Service. If we were to place this icon in the context of a process flow, the IoT picture would look as follows. On the left, we start off with physical devices that can send millions of messages. These messages are filtered and interpreted in the cloud. The cloud service then will reach out to the orchestrator when certain criteria are met and update the applications. Let us take a look now at a proof of concept demonstration with big yellow iron. We can do things like starting the engine and changing its status to working, or take it for a ride and update the longitude and latitude. On the right hand side we can track things like fuel, the state of the electrical controls and oil pressure. Any breach can create an event, for instance a loss of the electrical system will shut down a machine. Or a collision can be simulated which will then update the JD Edwards health and safety management applications. In the IoT cloud service we can see how many devices we are tracking and how many alerts have been created. In the lower right, we see that there have been five alerts, including the collision that was detected and the electrical system failure. We can also drill down further and review analytics pertaining temperature fluctuations, alarms and warnings, and meter readings. In the integration tab, we can see that JD Edwards truly is a fully integrated product and where we can see what kinds of updates and alerts we pass on to the orchestrator. Back in our Enterprise One page, and in addition to the studio where we create our orchestrations, we can also click the IoT Orchestrator icon. This brings us to the Orchestrator client where any business analyst can test and validate the connectivity as well as review the forms and fields that this particular orchestration will update. Once again, empowering your business analysts and allowing them to become citizen developers. Let us take a look at the applications. In this equipment master form, we can preview the asset, its status, and its location all in one form, thanks to the use of the Composite Application Framework, or CAFE-1. We can use a mobile app to track equipment in a certain radius. In this example, we search for front loaders within 50 miles of the current location. Notice in the lower right the Locate Equipment button. With this information, we can build out one view reports and dashboards that include watch lists. Our dashboard has four sections. Firstly, there is an overview of the equipment by status and by site. The meter reading tab keeps track of our runtime. The next section are the work orders that are assigned to Frank Planner, who is the user under which we are logged in. Lastly, Frank wants to keep track of the incidents by date and by asset. We can also visualize our equipment on a map and toggle between the equipment statuses. Each balloon can give us a quick overview of the outstanding alerts. We can include any form of content, for instance a meter reading. For more information on this demo, visit us at demo.oracle.com and search the demo store for JDE IoT.